There will be great confusion in the world. There'll be great confusion amongst the Muslim. There'll be absolutely violent deaths taking place. Killing, killing upon killing. And there will be disputes everywhere. There'll be disturbance and there'll be fear. Fear, people will not want to come out of their home. They will stay in their homes. They will lock themselves. And there will be many, many wars. Many wars and fitan upon fitan. That there will be trial and tribulation upon trial upon trial upon trial. To the extent that when uh, somebody will go for a trial, we think that this is it, this is the last one. And another one will appear. That until the hadith says, until a person will walk past the grave and he will say, I wish that I was in his place. This is how severe the fitna is going to be. This is just before the time of when Imam Mahdi comes. There shall come black flags from the east and then a war shall ensue between the Muslims. No ummah has ever undergone such a severe war. So he is saying black flags will come from the east, meaning the lands of Khorasan. So when you see the black flags, give bay'ah to the Mahdi, even if you have to crawl on snow to get to him. The whole ummah shall be controlled by one person from my progeny. And we also know that he shall enjoy the greatest khilafah ever known to the Muslims. Better than the Umayyads, better than the Abbasids, better than the Ottomans, better than all of the other khalifas that we've had. The Prophet wasallam said that there will be come a time, the Mahdi will come, he shall give money to everybody and not fear poverty, not even count it. And he said the fruit shall grow and the crop shall produce and everybody shall live in security and peace. This is after the Mahdi spreads justice, after the injustice. And he shall prepare the lands for the coming of Isa ibn Maryam. And when the, com when the coming of Isa ibn Maryam, the major signs of the Day of Judgment will start. And the Day of Judgment will literally be around the corner.